so here is the, the glomerular filtration barrier. And it's actually the damage of these cells right here, these endothelial cells, that get attacked by complement that seems to be the primary event in the pathogenesis of the entire disease. This is where it all starts. And so I'm going to talk to you today about, so this is another slide that I probably don't need at this point, but um, so this is the triad where you have that microangiopathic hemolytic anemia, and this is caused by that initial cell injury that um, the MAC complex causes. And what you get, so here's a glomerulus in a healthy individual, and you can see that the capillaries are nice and wispy and thin, and then in a patient with AHUS, you get these thrombi. And this was already explained wonderfully by Dr. Nestor, but basically what happens is when the blood flows through, it gets shredded. And that's where you get these schistocytes that um, everyone has been talking about and you can see here. And then also because of this, you get thrombocytopenia, which is just that low platelet count. And then in 50 to 90% of patients, depending on the mutation, depending on the circumstances, you can get renal failure.